Hi everyone, it's Donna here. I've got a project to show you that I'm pretty excited about um, for our new viewers Scrap and Craft and so I'm just going to show you where to see all this information. Okay, so you've got arnieviewerscrapandcraft.com.au You've got the Facebook group which is facebook.com slash crafty vera and friends and you've got my blog so go and check me out I'm at funtobehadhere.blogspot.com.au and I'm also on Facebook and it's called Donna's Fun Stuff Okay, so go and check us out see all the exciting stuff that's on them, on them sites and um, I hope you get something from it Now I want to show you my project. It is, uh, I got this idea of um, hot little tamale, I think it is, on on the, um, po uh, not Pinterest, on YouTube. Uh, and I've got all the link. I'll have all the links down below, okay? And it's also on Aunty Vida, Vida Scrap and Craft. And it's also on my blog where you can actually get the, um, her original project and um, what I've done is I kind of cased her folder I've got to be honest I didn't have the American sizes so I had to make my own so that was really interesting I tell you okay so there's my cover and um, this theme is Halloween um, for our Navira Scrap and Craft so this is my little folder that I, I created okay and these are the gorgeous papers that was um in, in the kit, her um, monthly kit, and uh, Hocus Pocus, okay? Now, what I did was this little girl, I fussy cut her out, and because she was so tiny on the paper, I actually um, enlarged her on the photocopier. So, you know, I think you're allowed to do that, because I have. Anyway, and I love this broom, and I wanted her to be on the front cover. So she cute as. Now I don't know if you can see. Yes, you can. There's lots of glitter. There's lots of shine, and that's right through this book. So I'm pretty chuffed. Okay. So and I'll show the paper clips in a minute. So you open it up, and there's the first two pages, and I've got lots of tags, and I've just used the cut what I call cutter parts. Um, they're from the kit. Uh, a 12 by 12 piece of paper and I've just got this kind of thing so I just cut them apart and and made a little pocket um, and decorated I guess the second one's the same um, I got this idea of little hot tamale as well and um, I love it and I've made heaps of them but mine doesn't look like hers mine's a little bit mm, okay maybe I need more practice okay uh, another paper clip and what I did I've got a really long tag um, and just a normal plain back but like a long tag but you, you can actually put photos in it you can put some memories in it you can do what you like in it really I suppose so it's up to you um, that one there is oh yep got it creepy um, I like this one this is one of my favourite pages um, it's again paper clip but I've got the tags again cut apart from the from the kit um, from the 12 by 12 piece of paper and this is the foam stickers that you got most of them are too big for card making or um, for something like this but there was a couple little ones but most of them are more like a scrapbook or big project but they're still they're beautiful they are let me show you see gorgeous and I like the eye I cut that fussy cut that out that eye and put some uh, glossy accents on it just to shine and I'm not sure if that's weird looking or not but hey I liked it so I don't really care okay this is one um, again another idea of Little Hot Tamale she uses crepe paper you know what I cannot buy black crepe paper anywhere over here in Tasmania so I actually use tissue paper and she cut all those off cut the sides and I actually left mine whole so I kind of like that, so it's individual, I guess. Um, the little ghost comes in the kit, uh, a die, absolutely gorgeous, wonderful. Again, I've got some cutter parts there, and a little a bulldog clip here, and that's just keeping the keeping it all together. Okay, turn it over, and mine turned out twice as big as hers did. Um, and I don't know how that happened, but I did mine by guesswork. 
so I guess maybe that was something to do with it. Uh, again, I used a little ta uh, cut apart out of the out of the um, paper that I got, and this is a Tim Holtz die, and all that information's on my blog, by the way, for what all this is. These little ones here is an embossing folder, and I just cut them out with a one and a quarter inch um, circle punch. Okay, this is one of my favourites. This has also got a tag in the side there, and again, it's uh, all just a bunch of hocus pocus, just a little bit of ribbon and and stuff. And and I've got to be honest, I really like it. I, I just think it looks looks great. Of course, I've got to get back in there and then fold it up, and then you put the clip back on to keep that together. Um, it's trick and treat. Um, I like this page too. See, that's one of them foam stickers. It's very, very big. Um, you could use it on something like this, and I certainly thought that was appropriate there. I really liked it. And I cut out, fussy cut out a little ghost as well and just stuck on there. Um, just to, to sort of ghostly um, kind of thing. Um, and a, a fence that didn't turn out properly. Um, but don't throw them away because it looks really great there. You know, it looks like a really old run-down kind of fence that's had it really um, this one I like this page too um, and on this one again this is the cutter parts and that one was um, just in a packet of um, little bits and pieces so I thought oh, why not use a round one again I've used it as glossy accents you can see that there just to get a little bit of definition in it just just to make it a little bit a little bit special I guess okay because otherwise Plain black could be very boring, and it is very boring. Um, and the la oh, we're back to the front. Okay, so it's quite a, a interesting little one. It was, I love doing it. Okay, so here's some. Here are some of the little um, uh, little tags and um, paper clip that I made. This one's a heart. I did a. a fussy cut a ghost in the house and just got a bling on there and and that's quite effective so it's layered so it looks great I loved him and as you've seen the little house now I watched a movie the other night called a house on a hill have you seen it it's just creepy as um, and when I made this little paper clip it reminded me so much of that and my husband said what's that round thing there and I said it's a moon and he, he was like what and I'm saying, yep, no imagination at all. But us crafty people, we can see that that is a moon, can't we? We can. Okay. So. Uh, and back to the, the front. And show and tell, I guess. Um, it, it looks so much prettier than actual photos. Okay. Have fun. Don't forget. Go and check anavirascrapandcraftout.com.au and please go and check out my blogs I've got tons of stuff on there nobody comes and visits me and that's simply because I don't sort of put it out there that much but please come and visit me say hi become a follower I would love to get to at least 50 that would be brilliant okay I'll catch you soon bye